Welcome to Chalift. Thank you for having us. No, it's a pleasure. How much did uh, uh, losing a member change the process to uh, record the new album? It made things simpler actually in the studio because when there's only two people, yeah. you can um, understand each other better. So it made, it made everything more direct and uh, simple. And both of us played all the, al all the different instruments on the album, so it was very, very simple. How much of a relationship is there, there are between video making and music making for you? For me, it's pretty similar, actually. Knowing how to, um, I learned how to make video first. So making music actually felt, or recording music felt very intuitive. You know, it's linear, it's, there's editing. You know, you can correct the color on both things. Videos actually seems like even more of an unfamiliar territory to me now that we've gotten to work on so much music. So I hope with this album, we're gonna have a lot of chances to um, make videos that go with the music. I'm starting to more and more realize the importance of having a visual that comes from the same people as the music does. What's going to be keeping you busy this next few months is scenes, touring, touring. A lot of touring. I'm getting married in May. Oh, congratulations! So we get two weeks off of touring, yeah. so I can get married. Are you just thinking about a new album? Yeah. <laughs> well, I'm already thinking about writing the next one. Yeah. yeah. But this this album has a lot of different flavors on it, kind of. So there's a lot of room to explore. Like, you know, it has elements of our personalities like that are aggressive and that are dreamlike and that are psychedelic and I, I think it's really fun both in the live show and um, in videos and stuff to really kind of get into playing with these different characters and different worlds so there's a lot to lot to digest for us still Just be Why did you choose to work with the producer Don Carey in London? Because he's a genius. Yeah. We fell in love. How was the, the col collaboration? What? It was really intuitive working with Dan. We all get excited about the same kind of things and you know Dan would help us understand when we'd gone too far or when something was missing. Yeah. We, we arrived in London with the songs almost completely worked out so Dan kind of was helping, helping us literally amplify the sounds and the songwriting and the album. You know, it was like he was, he just made everything stronger and hit harder. So it was, it was really great working with him. You said that uh, geeks are the new punks. So are you the new punks? Are the new what? Geeks punks. are the new punks? Yeah. You yeah. <laughs> yeah. Definitely. I don't know if we're geeky enough. I think there's, I think the rabbit hole can still get deeper, right? <laughs> it's funny now how like a producer is a way cooler thing than it used to be back in the 60s or... 50s or something that was that was the only geek in the studio and every everybody else was just a musician and then then musicians started to become pr producers and now being a producer is, is so cool yeah we're definitely geeks <laughs> yeah. Yeah, there's something about you that he understands. 